dogs. Books. Dilated eyeballs. This is Bedtime Book Reviews. Hello, and welcome to Bedtime Book Reviews. I'm Christine Dabo, and I'm the walrus. Cuckoo could you. On today's video, I would like to talk to you about two different yet equally exciting books that I have read recently. The first one is Sinful Rewards 3 by Cynthia Sachs. Now I have to start by saying the, the title is a, is a bit of a bait and switch. It, it really is. I'm sorry, Cynthia. I, I only try and say the best things about books on, on my videos, but, but Sinful Rewards 3 there was no menage in this book. There, there, there was no menage. I just I started reading. I'm in the middle of this story. I'm like, the hell? Who is this B person? And, and why is there even a competition between a biker and a billionaire? I mean, biker, tattoos, hot shit between his legs, people. You know, like, okay, the other guy's got a billion dollars and a limo. But he keeps telling me he's an asshole. And I'm like, biker dude? Yeah. And then I was expecting the threesome. I mean, come on, get the biker in the limo with B. That's sexy fun times right there. But no, no, there was none of that. It was all like, do I have to choose between one or the other? And I'm like, lady, come on, get them together. Get the shirts off. Let's see some abs. And then, you know, there was a... Uh, uh, hang on. What? It, it's a cereal? Uh, oh, it's book three. Ah, uh, oh, of 12? One a month. So I've missed two? How the hell did that happen? Okay. Thank you. Um, so I take that back. It's book three in a 12 book series. Serial. It's one story. It's one story. I knew that. It was one story. It was book three. So I'm going to go back. And read the other two books. And then I'm going to tell you about those up to that point. Because, because yes, you should do this. They're only a dollar a book. It's three, less than a cup of coffee. And if you drink coffee the way I drink coffee, trust me, I could probably stand to, to cut back on some of that. So the other book that I think I'll, I've just finished reading, I want to tell you a little bit about, is this one. Now, this has been out for a little bit. I'm slow. If you can see the stack beside me here, I, I'm behind in my reading. But this little gem was sitting in there, and I dug it out because Mary Balog has a place in my heart. I just, I, I just love her. Just love her books. And this one, yes, yes. Uh, it's book one in a new series, and um, um, it's called The Survivor's Club. This is The Proposal. The next one is called The Arrangement. That one's over there, too. I'm going to read that one next. Uh, and, yes, this takes us. It's still in her world that she's created, so you do see a few characters making an appearance. You know, there's a certain duke in here that I kind of went, <laughs> I actually made that noise. Jack, Jack made that noise, too. Right, Jack? Is this book Jack approved? He got down. Um, so, so, this. If you like historicals, if you like Mary Balog, if you like abs, because we can tell he's the hero. And there's the heroine. She has a dress, and it's purple. Yeah, you should get this. He's wounded, mentally scarred from, from battle and dying and death, and, and she has a limp. Really, you can't go wrong with a heroine with a limp. And and Mary Ballard pulls off the limp very well. And and I read this in a night. And then slightly the next morning, it was a little hazy if I had actually fallen asleep or not. So yes, do all those things. Read this book. Serial Sinful Rewards. Book three came out. I'm assuming now that I know that there's a Next month. 
Okay. I would also like to take this moment to, to thank everyone for, for really the comments after that first video were, were just astounding to me. I mean, I received things like uh, from a Mr. T. Roll who said, Christine really needs to get these things off of YouTube because she's corrupting them. Um, and really, I, I took that to mean that, you know, they, they have a place and, and we're finding it. We're finding the niche. And then more importantly to me, I mean, comments from, from my, my family, my family who, who have always been there to support me. Um, for example, my, my oldest daughter, uh, when she found out that I was doing these videos and that they were on YouTube, her, her reaction was really telling. It, 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 it meant a lot. It was, um, let me see if I can find the, oh yes, she said, why are you doing this to me? You're ruining my life. Uh, which, which for me, it just, you know, like right here, right here. And it's going to stay there locked, locked forever. Love. And that's what, what romance writing is all about, really. The love. Until next time, have fun in bed. This book is Jill approved. Next time on Bedtime Book Reviews, do I read this book or do I play with my toys? Tune in to find out.